Hi, Daniel. Hello, teacher. How are you? Fine. How are you? Nice. I'm here at my workplace. Yes, I can tell. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hello, teacher. Hi, Mariano. Tenía como mil días de no verlo, Mariano. Momentito. Teacher. How are you? Fine. How are you? Fine. Good. All right. Very good. Niños, he perdido mis lentes. Por ahí que me No los ando en la cabeza. Perdón, Daniel, que ya le di vuelta a todo. <laughs> anyway. All right. Very nice. Hi, Domingo. Good evening, teacher. Hi, Roberto. Hi, Domingo. How are you, guys? Everything okay? Yes, I'm fine. Excellent, very good. Hi, Walter. Hi, good evening, teacher. Good evening. Just give me a second, guys. I just need to do something. Just give me a second. Hi, Carlita. Hi, Bismar. Carlita, ¿cómo siguió? Ya un teacher. poco mejor, teacher. Me alegro oírla, Carla. Ya la escuchamos mejor. <laughs> ya se me escucha un poquito mejor, sí. Sí, very nice. Hi, Bismar. Perdone, how are you? I'm fine. Thank you, teacher. Excellent. Thank you for being in class. Very good, guys. So we're going to continue. Let me just get my book here. So we'll start with what we have to do today. We're just going to review where we stopped last class. And then we are going to continue with um, the, the training manual that I told you that we're going to start today. All right, so let me see here. That's the book. Uh, let me just get this for you. All right, yeah, that's the, that's the one. All right, so last uh, last week or last classes, we were talking about uh, some sequence words that we use, all right? The idea, me congelé. No. No. No, seguro, so que vi que me quedé frozen. Yeah, no, no. Ok, estamos bien. <ríe> All right, lo que pasa es que perdí mis lentes, entonces no veo bien. All right, entonces todo se me ve así como frozen. <ríe> All right, a ver, entonces, I was telling you that last week we were, we were talking about some sequence words. Se las voy a volver a mostrar por lo que vamos a empezar a hacer hoy. All right, igual para Carlita que estuvo enfermita, para... Manuel, que algunos días no logró entrar, eh, igual Roberto, igual Walter, all right, y Bismar, all right, para nada más ponerlos otra vez en el, en el mood, all right, aparte es Monday, entonces es como que a veces se nos olvida, todos nos relajamos tanto que we forget about our English classes, all right, so I'm just going to show you this again, all right, so here no pasa nada, no, esto no es lo que estoy compartiendo, ¿por qué estoy compartiendo esto? It's an exercise. All right, so these, yeah, here. These are the words, guys, that we were talking about last class, all right? So it's important for you, si en caso no le logró tomar foto, captura o algo, yo creo que si Debbie la subió, all right? But in case these are very, very important, last week, we realize that we can use or we can change the words we already know for new words. Y eso es importante, ¿verdad? Para que usted ya deje de decir por decirle algo, 
uh, finally, or I don't know, just also or to, all right? So we can use many other words y son sinónimos de ellas mismas. Entonces es como que nice to have more vocabulary, more understanding, more words that we can use. Acá se les ha clasificado en emphasis, addition, contrast, or order. All right, so we have those. Again, esas no son todas, hay más. All right, y como ustedes están buenos estudiantes, tienen que seguir investigando un poquito más sobre otras palabras. All right, so to increase your vocabulary. Pero con esta sobra y basta por ahorita of what we're going to be working on today. All right. Aparte de esto, we saw procedures. All right. Hi, Johnny. Hi, Bane. Hi, Evan. Hi, Jorgito. And Debbie, no los había saludado. All right. So we were also talking about procedures. We were talking about steps on a procedure. All right. And today we're going to be talking about how to make a training manual. All right. Now. Les decía y les trataba de explicar la semana pasada antes de retirarnos, especialmente para los chicos que vienen desde el básico 1 o desde el básico 1, todos los básicos. All right. Y la, digamos que la metodología cambia porque ya les hacía mención. La unidad 2 se extiende dos semanas. All right. Y no es precisamente una como trabajamos, al menos conmigo, una página y del libro y luego nos, nos ponemos a hacer las actividades. En esta vez, si yo me pusiera a hacer las Página por clase, ya hubiésemos terminado la unidad 2, ¿verdad? Entonces, vamos a ir por segmentos y ahí nos vamos a, a desarrollar la clase. Entonces, eh, con eso en mente, I want you to go to your book on page 21 y nada más nos vamos a enfocar en number 3, pair work. Y eso, teacher, eso lo vamos a ver después. Y lo demás, teacher, también. All right, pero hoy por hoy is this number three that we need to work on. Now, here it says, read the content. This is the content in a server's training manual. Remember that this unit is talking about restaurant. All right, ahora, como bien se los decía también eh, durante todo lo que llevamos del curso, acuérdense que aprendemos esto que es inglés para el trabajo, pero tratamos de socializarlo de tal forma que usted lo pueda entender, comprender y usar en un contexto cualquiera, desde cotidiano hasta su trabajo, que no necesariamente es the restaurant industry. All right, it's like anything that you can use it on. All right, so here it says, servers training manual. Quiere decir que servers son quienes. Who are the servers in a restaurant? Anybody, any ideas? Who are the servers? Waiter. The waiter. Yes. The waiter and the waitress. All right. Yes. Those are the servers. Si usted quiere no entrar en eso de género o se se le olvida, usted puede decir server y es lo mismo que waiter or waitress. All right. Very good. So this is uh, the content of a, a server's training manual. It says. Organize the topics to create the index of the manual on the right. Then present your index to the class and explain the reasons for your choice. Now, here we have many topics or contents, all right? For example, we have setting a table, decanting wine, requesting a shift change, following the schedule. Addressing kitchen, addressing, sorry, addressing kitchen personnel, getting to know the menu, dress code, addressing customers, about tips and taxes, and prevention of accidents and safety. All right. Antes de cualquier otra cosa que vayamos a hacer, please read it again, donde dice server training manual, and make sure you understand everything. Do you understand all the vocabulary that we have there? Si no, you tell me which ones and I will help you. If everything is okay, you tell me, teacher, everything is just fine. Teacher, about uh, requesting a shift. Change is like uh, in my case, uh, uh, 
when I need to change my my gray, my gray, my yes, my my gray shift. That's right. I I talk to my coworker. He I need this gray free. This is this is about. Yes, it is. Uh huh. When okay. you, oh, okay. yes, it is Nadia. When you request it, is when you ask. All right, you ask okay. your supervisor or your boss. Listen, I have, for example, I have a doctor's appointment. I need to change my shift. All right. Okay. Okay. That's what it is, Daniel. Okay. Very good. Okay. Thank you. Daniel, it can only be the time or it can also be the day. All right. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yep. Yeah, very Thank good. You. Thank you, Daniel. Very nice. Any other question, guys? Do you understand all the vocabulary that we have here? Teacher, what is the canting? Ah, like trying wine. It's like tasting it. Then, uh, can I say the canting water? Uh, or the canting horchata? <laughs> the carao. The carao, I don't know. No, the canting is more like um, tasting it, trying it. When you, um, how do you call it? All right, when you serve it, uh, Johnny, when you serve the wine, for example, you are slowly putting the wine on the cup, on the glass wine. All right, it's like sir servir el vino. Es para que el cliente lo apruebe, for the, uh -huh. for the customer approve the, the, the wine. Yeah. The, fla the flavor, the temperature. Yes, but also, Daniel, the way you put it on the on the wine glass. Yes, yes, on the wine glass. It's a little, it's a, it's a, it's a sample. Yeah, but yes, it is, Daniel, but it's mm -hmm. also en la acción de llenar la copa del vino. Ah, okay, the canting wine, okay. Perfect. como que gaseosa. It's like, así como, I don't know, lo, lo sirven, ellos saben cómo servir. Como la degustación. Es más como okay. la, la acción de servir el vino. El vino. The correct procedure to uh -huh. serve the wine. Yes. Es, es como quien te saca la cerveza en, en la jarra y te dice, le sirvo la copa. Uh, es sabido. Yes, yeah, I don't know, but a mí. Ok. <laughs> es el servir el vino. Eh, uh -huh. Only for wine. Only for wine, yes. Or solutions, pero soluciones químicas. Y en este caso de los restaurantes, it's only wine. Okay, thank you. Yes, thank you. All right, any other? Do we understand addressing kitchen personnel and addressing customers? Entendemos esas expresiones. Voy a dejar de compartir un ratito. Do we understand addressing customers and addressing personnel? Teacher. Yes. Hey. Y yo, teacher, yo no, no understand las expresiones realmente como yo no estuve el viernes, no sé si el viernes me estuvo viendo, va a disculpar. Ah, no, 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 no se preocupe, Claudita. De hecho, ahorita es primera vez. Claudita, ¿por qué no la veo? Tiene la camarita apagada. Sí, ahorita sí es que estoy. No, no, con mi papá. Sí, no, no, tranquila. Lo que pasa es que pensé que había apretado yo algo y por eso no la veía. <risa> No, 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 ya, ya vamos a ver una forma, all right, para que estemos, like, sure of what, all right? Okay, thank you. Thank you, Claudita. Anybody else? No, teacher, I don't, I don't make sense to this uh, phrase, addressing kitchen personal. Addressing is not, is not, la, es, no es dirección, ¿verdad? No. O direccionar, no, ¿verdad? It's different. Yes, 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 yes. Una cosa, the address, the email address, my personal address, pero address. Yes. Oh. Addressing. Uh -huh. yes. Roberto, do you have any idea what addressing a uh, customer yes, yes. or, uh -huh, or personnel, Roberto? Do you know what it means? No, teacher, no. 
el trato, cómo tratamos a los empleados, cómo tratamos mm, a los clientes. Okay. Eh, ¿Podrían a veces encontrar esto? How to address, uh, por decir algo, the owner. The CEO of your company, for example. Entonces, la pregunta es, how to address the CEO of your company? ¿Cómo, cómo se dirige usted al, al, al CEO? ¿Cómo se dirige? ¿Cómo lo trata? All right. ¿Cómo se dirige a él? Así como, hey, ¿qué onda? So it's like, hello, how are you? All right. So you have to know how to address someone. All right. Okay. Entonces, es diferente al contexto o a la forma que hemos siempre es, a tener conocimiento de address, es dirección. All right, but not in this case. It's how to treat people. Okay, yes. All right, voy a, a pasar asistencia ahorita en lo que sigan revisando ahí. Y ya nos vamos a ir uno por una, Claudita, así que no se preocupe. Very good. Uh, today is Monday the 28th. All right, let's see. Adela Trinidad González con suegra. Trini va llegando. Very nice. Carlos Eduardo Melgar Rivas. Presente, Chia. Claudia Guadalupe Arias de Gómez. Presente, Chia. Daniel Antonio Luna. Presente, Chia. Debbie Jasmine Girón Ramírez. Presente, Chia. Domingo Alexander González. Presente, Chia. Ever de Jesús Candrae Montano. Presente, Chia. Johnny Omar Torres Mata. Presente. Jorge Alfredo Argueta Flores. Presente. José Roberto Martínez Bernabé. Presente. Carla Benacir Lara González. Presente. Carlita Leticia Guadalupe García de Miranda. Present teacher. All right. Eh, Linda Stephanie Ramírez Abrego. Manuel Antonio Escamilla Jurado. Present teacher. María Gabriela Batres Mármol. Good evening, present. Hi. All right, Mariano José Paca Santa María. Present teacher. Vanessa Noemí Reyes Lemos. Present. Vicky Dinora Gutiérrez de Durán. All right, Bismar Ulises Martínez Ortiz. Present teacher. Thank you. Walter Omar Castaneda Perlera. Presente. Julio César Vega Aguilar. Then we have Doris Guadalupe Alfaro Rodríguez. Ah, Victoria María Vázquez Juárez. Present. Thank you. And Joana Beatriz Orellana Acevedo. All right, very nice, guys. Today is the 28th. Oh my goodness, we're flying in time, guys. Very nice. Okay, so I'm going to share my screen with you again. All right. So setting a table, I'm just going to review it so you guys know it. En caso que no saben, pues les va a caer bien. Si en caso ya sabían, pues es un repaso. Setting a table is putting the table, making the table look nice, clean, organized. All right. Set the table, put the plates, the cups, the glass wine, the, ta the, the spoons, the forks. Everything nice and beautiful on a table. That's setting a table. Decanting wine is the action of pouring the wine on the cup or the glass wine. All right. That's like the action of it. All right. Number three, requesting a shift change when you ask to switch your schedule, the times of your, of your work. For example, if I work in the morning, but I cannot work in the morning tomorrow, I call my boss and I request to change. I will work in the afternoon 
and uh, Julio will work my shift. So we change the shifts, all right? We change horarios, all right? So that would be shift change. Following the schedule is like every day you go to your work from eight to five and you follow this schedule, all right? You go every day without a problem. Number five, addressing kitchen personnel. Ya dijimos que era el, the treatment. Como me dirijo, como trato a esa persona. In this case, it's kitchen personnel. Acuérdese que estamos hablando de servers, waiters or waitresses, all right? Next one, getting to know the menu is important. Imagínese que usted trabaja en el restaurante y le preguntan, ¿y esto qué lleva? Y usted como, um, I don't know. <laughs> All right, you need to know the food. All right, what is in it? All right, not only the names, but what the food contains. What does the food have in it? The taste, is it good? Is it sour? Is it sweet? Is it hot? Is it spicy? You need to know the menu. Dress code. Dress code is the way you dress. Si es un, a, a nice formal restaurant, they, the waiter or the waitress or the server has to look with a white shirt, a black uh, bow tie. Sorry, guys. Black pants, all right, a, a dress code. No va a llegar así en jeans y whatever si el restaurante tiene un uniforme. So that's a dress code, all right? Then we have addressing customers, lo mismo o parecido al addressing kitchen personnel. How do you talk to customers, all right? You have to greet them, lo saluda, all right? So you have to talk to them. About tips and taxes. Tips son las propinas y taxes son los impuestos. All right. So, en muchos restaurantes ya la propina va dentro del, res, de la, del recibo o de la factura del consumo. All right. En otros no, you, still have, you have to leave the tip. Ahora, in some restaurants, como ya se cobra la, el tip o la propina, se divide entre todas las personas. All right. If not, every restaurant has their own rules. So I don't know the rules, all right? And the last one, prevention of accidents and safety. Safety, seguridad, all right? Prevention of accidents, all right? So these are the service training manual. Any questions about this? Nos queda todo claro? Everything is clean, Tisha. Everything is clear? Teacher. Yes. Repeat, please, about getting to know the menu. Ah, okay. Conocer el menu. All right. Mm. You have to know no solo lo, the names of the food, Johnny, but the ingredients. All right. The flavor. All right. Especially if it's a, like a new dish. De repente, si usted tiene un nuevo plato, en el caso de un restaurante, la persona le va a decir, ah, mire, más si usted lo ofrece, ¿verdad? Le van a preguntar, ¿y qué lleva? ¿Y, y, y cuál es? ¿Cómo sabes? Es, es, oh, es picante, es, I don't know, lleva mucha especie. Si usted le dice, así se casa, ver. <laughs> All right, so that's not a good, um, someone that knows about the, the food, right? Okay, teacher. Thank you. All right, anybody else? Teacher. Uh, requesting a shift change, can you explain me? Yes, when you request a, a shift change is when, <clears throat> when you have to work. For example, you you cannot work in the afternoon and you ask your, your boss. Esto obviamente pasa cuando permítame que viene una huella bien grande. Cuando tenemos horarios rotativos, ¿verdad? En el caso de Daniel, por ejemplo, Daniel trabaja días de noche, días de día. All right. Entonces, en el caso de Daniel, pues si pudiera ser el, 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 la situación que él necesite una, trabajar una noche extra para cambiar porque era el cumpleaños de su hijo y lo quería celebrar. All right. O you need to go to the hospital. Ahora, los que tienen trabajos como fijos, eh, pues, pueden request permission del día, 
o de la hora, all right? pero no es que cambien horario, ¿verdad? Entonces, requesting a shift change es cambio de horario. Requerir o pedir un cambio. Okay. De... Very good. Any other? Okay. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Any other? ¿Alguna otra pregunta? El de dress code nos quedó claro. What is dress code? Yes? Yes, teacher. All right. Okay. Teacher. Yes, John. It's código de vestimenta? Yes, it is, yes. John. All right. Dress code. Okay. okay. What are we going to do? Eso es lo primero que vamos a hacer y después vamos a quedarnos hablando más eh, a detalle de what is a training manual. Vamos a hacer este porque ya está como ejemplo. All right. Y luego vamos a hacer nosotros uno. You're supposed, vamos a seguir estas instructions here. Organize the topics. Esos son los topics del server, server's training manual. To create an index of the manual on the right. Then present your index to the class and explain the reasons of your choice. ¿Qué van a hacer entonces? Acá todos tenemos los mismos temas que van dentro del training manual. Pero no es el orden en el que se van a desarrollar dentro del manual. Usted en cada grupo, cada quien va a llevar un orden diferente, lo más probable. Ustedes con su grupo, yo estoy trabajando con Mariano y con Walter, decidimos cuál de estos temas va primero. All right? ¿Cuál va segundo, tercero, cuarto, hasta que terminemos todos? ¿Cuál es que usted, ustedes consider, considerarían que es the last topic? All right? But al mismo tiempo, no solo voy poniendo por decir algo, ah, para mí por decir algo. Prevention of accidents and safety is number one. Pero aquí dice, mire, explain the reasons of your choice. No solo va a venir a decirme, teacher, number one tal, number two tal, number three tal. No, you tell me why. ¿Por qué usted, ustedes en su grupo con Mariano y Walter decidieron, all right, que prevention of accidents and safety is number one? ¿Sí me entienden? Yes. Ok, entonces para todos hay una razón del que ustedes pensaron en su grupo. Why is number one? Why is number four? Why is number six? All right, or why is the last one? Ok, guys. Y lo van a presentar. Entonces sí necesito que lo trabaje. Ahorita le estoy ya habilitando el compartir pantalla, Johnny, antes que me regañe. <laughs> oh, yes, I know, Johnny. All right, listos, listas. Yes, we understand what, we, what to do. Yes, yeah. teacher. Right. Les va a llevar yes, un Igual yo estoy monitoreando, entro para ver cómo va. Claudita va a poder entrar, Claudita, o ahorita no. Yes, teacher. Oh, perfecto. All right, perfect. Vamos a hacer entonces. Ten groups. Yep. All right, guys, let's go.
Hola, buenas noches. Hi, teacher. Hola. We have a question. We forgot what does addressing kitchen personnel and also addressing customer mean. Uh, it's the way you treat them. It's the way you talk to them. Ah, okay. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, entonces serían should be that that uh those first. Okay. Entonces lo dejamos ahí. Mm -hmm. Sí, tendría que ser primero ah, el personal y luego tal vez al customer. Y este de
Thank you. What? What is on the menu? What is on? What is what? What? Is on? Uh -huh, what? What is one? What is one the menu? Yes. What is on the menu? Mm -hmm. Okay. Número siete. El número siete. The Kating Wine. Es? The Kating Wine, no sé. The Kating Wine. Este que era el following the chart. The eh, following es siguiendo el horario. Following this schedule. Uh -huh. Así me pasa para el yeah. palabra. Schedule. 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 Hola. Hola, ¿me escuchan? Hola, hola, teacher. Hola, ya soy yo. <risa> following, following the schedule. Mm. Schedule. 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 Ok. 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 To the customer. Mm -hmm. okay, uh, dar un mejor servicio a los clientes ofreciendo bebidas de una mm -hmm. forma agradable. Sí, o también estar, estar pendiente. Estar pendiente si se le. O sea, para que no se quede pues sin, sin el vino. Or to write the offer to bring the client. Or no, avoid accident of them. And eh, para, para referirse a la última, a la última. Ajá, digo ya para resumirlo un poquito. Very important. Ah, entonces, the, the last. Mm -hmm. Okay, the last last one. one. It's important. No, it's important. To avoid accidents and como de acuerdo a las important to avoid accidents como siguiendo following the following the rules the 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 manual. The manual play, algo así. Pero eh, eh, de referirse a. Hello, teacher. Hi, ¿cómo vamos? So that. Ya I estamos so so. <laughs> tratando de explicar. <laughs> very, very nice, thank you. Thank you. But to be sure, last but not least, it's important to avoid accidents following the rules. Hi, Brian. 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 Hi,
busy. Hola Vicky, me escucho. Hi teacher. How are you? I'm fine. Excellent. <laughs> And, dice que están terminando una actividad. No sé si quiere entrar solo para escuchar o me espera aquí. No, aquí le espero. Mejor todo lo que eso me cambie. Está bien. Bueno, gracias, Ticho. Teacher, eh, yo voy a seguir trabajando aquí en mi casa, entonces ahorita eh, voy a estar escuchando la clase, pero no voy a poder estar participando mucho. Ok, Vicky, no se preocupe. <risa> Gracias, teacher. <risa> Hello, Leti. Hi, Daniel. ¿Cómo vamos? Hello, teacher. Aquí vamos ya. Vamos. Okay. Ya llevamos eh, dos en la mitad. Excellent. Very nice. Yep. Uh -huh. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Getting the load the men. Subsequently, subsequently, mm, address code. ¿Cómo vamos? Tratando de unir todo. Explain uh, why, why uh, choose the index. Excellent. Entonces, me dijo la forward de que hecho sería. La second o
<clears throat> All right, guys, I'm going to take attendance right now. And then we're going to choose some groups to present your results. All right, veamos. Adela Trinidad González con suegra. Trini. Carlos Eduardo Melgar Rivas. Present teacher. Present. Trini, thank you, Carlos. Claudia Guadalupe Arias de Gómez. Present teacher. Thank you, Claudita. Daniel Antonio Luna. Present teacher. Evi Jasmine Giron Ramirez. Present teacher. Thank you, Domingo Alexander González. Present teacher. Eh, Ever de Jesús Candray Montano. Present. Johnny Omar Torres Mata. Present. Jorge Alfredo Argueta Flores. Present teacher. José Roberto Martínez Bernabé. Present teacher. Carla Benacir Lara González. Present. Leticia Guadalupe García de Miranda. Present teacher. Leti. Linda Stephanie Ramírez Abrego. Present teacher. Manuel Antonio Escamilla Jurado. Present teacher. María Gabriela Batres Mármol. Present. Mariano José Pacas Santa María. Present teacher. Vanessa Noemí Reyes Lemos. Present teacher. Y Dinora Gutiérrez de Durán. Present teacher. Bismar Ulises Martínez Ortiz. Present teacher. Walter Omar Castaneda Perlera. Present teacher. Julio César Vega Aguilar. Doris Guadalupe Alfaro Rodríguez. And Joana Beat. Ah, no, Victoria María Vázquez Juárez. Present. Victoria and Joana Beatriz Orellana Acevedo. Well, los compañeritos que pueden tener sus cámaras encendidas, please. Thank you. All right, let's see. Vamos a ver, hoy no me quiero sentir culpable. A ver, Debbie, mi asistente que manda las fotos. Debbie, regáleme un número. <ríe> no, usted me va a regalar un número, no me va a decir. Regáleme un número del 1 al 10. El 8. El Antonio. <ríe> ah, ok. <ríe> Thank you, Debbie. Ya ve, hoy no soy. <ríe> Debbie. Thank you, Debbie. Yeah, very nice. All right. Uh, Manuel and uh, Mariano, can you share your screen, please, and tell us about your manual? Okay, teacher. Manuel, did you share your screen? Oh, I, I, don't, I don't write in the computer only in my paper. Hmm. Alexander, you don't have it either. Espérame, teacher, no sé cómo compartir esto. Estoy en mi tablet. Mm -hmm. Se ve. Sí, sí, se ve. Ok. Eh, ahí los. Oh, eh, this is the order. Ok. Eh, the number one is a dress code. Ok. Eh, look up servers. It's important to represent a restaurant imaging. I image. Ok. Restaurant image. All right. Image. Después, ajá, image. Very good. Eh, number to addressing customer. The customer servers is important to servers be training in how to address to customer. The number three, addressing kids in personal. Uh, it's important to be polite with the partner's works. Okay. Uh, number four and five, it's necessary to do. Uh, number four, following the schedule, and number five, to request and shift change. Okay. It's in, it's necessary to define the schedule's works. Okay. So uh, you, you put it together, Manuel and, and Mariano, number four and five. is related. Yes, sir. Yes. Yep. All right. Okay. Uh, y no habíamos terminado. <laughs> All right. <laughs> okay. That's okay. 
Okay, Mariano. So for number six, you have prevention of accidents and safety. Number yes, six. Eight, and getting to now the menu. Eight, setting eight, the table. Uh -huh. Eight, nine, the kind of wines. And number 10 is about tipping taxes. All right. Okay. Very good. Okay. All right. Thank you. Very good, uh, Mariano and Manuel. Thank you for that. Okay. All right. Let's see. Let's uh, see. Thank you, Debbie. Sigamos. Debbie is my assistant estrella. All right. Another number. Cualquier reclamo, Six. Number six. Veamos. Number six is. Jorgito and Victoria. No, mentira, 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 mentira. Claudita and Roberto. Y Jorgito así como, no, yo no. <laughs> Claudia and Roberto. No sé si. Eh, okay. Roberto, creo que lo voy a compartir, Roberto. Okay. Yes. Thank you, Roberto. Oh, nice. Very nice. Okay. Uh, teacher, we did it in two parts. I will give two first. Uh, in number one is following the school. Number two, the school. Number three is, is let's see, no veo muy pequeño. Creo que no veo nada ahora. Lo voy a decir por aquí. <laughs> sí, Roberto, thank you. <laughs> no, All right, yeah. Disculpe, no. excuse me, excuse me. Uh, ay, ay, ay. Ay, yes, thank you. Uh, uh, but number three, getting to know the menu. Okay. Uh, number four, prevention of accidental safety. Okay. And uh, uh, number five, Addressing kit personal. Number six, addressing customer. Seven, setting a table. A, the counting. Why? Nine is about tip and taxes. Okay. A, ten, requested a tip change. All right. Okay. Um, Roberto. Okay. First. Uh, there's a comment. First, employee have to know the schedule of activities. Second, they have to know the correct form to dress. In addition, get, getting to know the menu. Importantly, or personal know about prevention of accident and safety. It's important. Uh, ad Addressing? Addressing kitchen of a good working environment. Addressing? Uh, yes, good working environment, yes. Before um, setting a table in order to decanting wine, apart from this, now, uh, sorry. now about tips and taxes, Last but not least, requesting a shift change when necessary. Very nice, thank you. Roberto, no lo quite, no lo quite, ahorita voy. First the employee, me gustó que le puso first y puso la coma. <laughs> first the employee <laughs> have to know the schedule of activities. Second, they have to know the correct forms, the, the correct form to dress. All right. In addition, getting to know the menu, importantly, all person, en lugar de personal, es personnel. Doble N con E, Roberto. Mm -hmm. Okay. Personnel about prevention of accidents and safety. Luego, después de safety, it is. It is important. Addressing, addressing kitchen personnel and addressing customers to have a good working environment. Yes, very nice. Before setting a table in order to decant in wine. Yeah, they need to know how to do that. Apart from this, know about tips and taxes. All right. Okay. Last but not least, requesting a shift change when necessary. They have to know that, right? Very good. Thank you, Roberto. Thank you, Claudia. Thank you. Thank you. All right, Debbie. Seguimos, Debbie. <laughs> ten. Number ten. Let's see who's number ten. Ten we have Linda and Bunny. Okay. 
Vane tal vez puede compartir. Give me a second. All right. Yes, thank you. Okay. The order for us. See? Yes, I can see. Yes, Vane. Yes. Uh, the order for us, uh, number one, dress call. Number two, addressing customers. Three, setting the table. Four, getting to know the menu. Five, decanting wine. Six, addressing kitchen personnel. Seven, following the schedule. Eight, about tips and taxes. Nine, requesting a chief change and 10 prevention of accident and safety. When, uh, when I serve and hire, the principal point that they must know is the dress code because it's the first imp impression for the customer. Okay. Also, they have to know, the, the waiters have to know how to give the best service and make to feel customers satisfied. Apart from this, the serve have to learn, learn how to set the table and explain the menu according to the customer need. Um, last one of the list is important to follow the indication manual in order to avoid accidents and achieve a safety from customer and workers. All right. Very good. Thank you. No, no me lo quite, Vane. Um, thank you. Very nice. Let's see. When a server, when a server. All right. Veamos la primera oración. Um, when a server is hired or lo podemos dejar en plural y decimos when servers are hired. Pero le quitamos el a si lo vamos a hacer plural o le ponemos is porque solo es un server. Yes. When oh, server okay. is plural. When servers could be cualquiera de las dos lo puede poner plural o singular pero tenemos que adecuarlo verdad when servers uh -huh. ese? Uh -huh. when are servers hired. are hired ajá uh -huh. o lo dejaba vale when a server is hired is. ajá uh -huh. the principal point that they must know is the dress code because it's the first impression for the customer. For. Yeah, mm -hmm. for the customer. Also, they have to know about, they have to know how to give the best service and make, okay, uh, the service and make, make, and make customers feel satisfied. And make customers. Satisfied. See, make, Customers. Así o con. No, 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 sin apostrofe. Okay. Ajá. Feel satisfied. Satisfied con ied, no satisfied. Satisfied. Apart from this, the server. Un, un server o varios. Mm, varios. Varios. Apo con al server. The server. Mm -hmm. No, ahí, ahí, ahí. The servers have to know. Sorry. Uh, quítele el artículo da. Antes del server, Vane. Ahí, uh -huh. Servers have to learn how to set the table and explain a menu according to customers. Ahí sí va, customers. Va ese y luego el apóstrofe. Porque son varios. Ah, customers. Uh -huh. Ahí va el apóstrofe. No, no, no. Ponga ese, no, al revés, porque son varios clientes. Customers. Ahí va la apóstrofe. The need. No, en después de la S, eh, Vane. Ay, Sería apóstrofe. No, ahí va, ahí va porque es plural. Ya les voy a explicar. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Ah, last but not least, it is, it is uh, primordial or to follow. Quítele el ING y déjelo en, en base, follow. The indication manual in order to avoid accidents and achieve safety from customers and workers. Very good. Thank you. Nice. Yeah, very good. 
Thank you, teacher. Thank you. Thank you. Excellent. Ahí viene otra bulla, permita. <laughs> Debbie, ready? Vamos a hacer uno más, Debbie. Mm. Juan. Yo sabía que Juan iba a decir. A ver, ¿quién está trabajando con Walter? Me... Ah, Trini. Right. Right. Eh, Walter, do you have your screen to share? Yes. All right. I share now. Los otros sí, I can see. Eh, antes que Walter empiece, los otros grupos igual tomo foto y mañana continuamos. All right? No se preocupe que aquí ya les he dicho yo que nadie se escapa. All right, Walter, yes. Well, we put first uh, prevention of accidents and safety. Because the safety is the most important thing in, in a workplace. Second, dress code, because the good presentation of the service in the restaurant. Next, uh, setting a table, the group organize and presentation of the service in the restaurant, follow the scheduler, service on time to the customers. Next, getting note to the menu offer the correct dishes to the customers and describe the ingredients about all dishes in the menu. Uh, my coworker can continue. Addressing customer is important because the restaurant needs the client a way happy and satisfied with a good service. Addressing kitchen personnel with a better relationship of, of co-workers, more efficient and harmonized in the restaurant. The catering wine give a better service to the Customer and offering drink near it about in for to pay a good service and make correct payment. Requesting a chief change for the work week. All right, thank you. All right, prevention of accidents and safety, the safety. Quítele el da y solo dejamos safety is, safety is the most important thing in a workplace. The good presentation of the service in the restaurant. Restaurant, conté al final. Good uh, setting, setting a table. Uh, good organization, in this case, it would be a good organization and presentation of the service in the restaurant. Service on time to customers in time. Service on time to customers. Que tener el da y póngale el to. To customers para darle el, el, el servicio a tiempo al cliente. Uh -huh. uh, offer sin la te. Offer the correct dishes to the customers and describe the ingredients about all dishes in the menu. All right, addressing customers. I see it is important because the restaurant needs. No, it's important. Uh -huh. All right, oh, con el apostrofe, verdad? Pero está bien así. It is important because the restaurant needs, es un restaurante singular, needs ese después de la bit need, needs the client, needs the, needs the client. Always happy and satisfied with, good, with a good service, very good. Uh, with a better relationship of co workers, more. Okay. Efficiently, doble F. An harmonic, si no estoy mal, sin la E, in the restaurant. 
give a better service to the customer and offering, offering, offering. Sin las té. Offering drinks when the client needs it. Con ese, need. In forms to pay. In forms, forms lleva ese, pays, no. A good service and make correct payment. Requesting a shift change for complete with the works schedule in the week. Very good. Or during the week. Está bien, super bien. Thank you. Yeah, very good. All right. So tomorrow. All right. Ya les digo quién me va a faltar. Yo, um, el grupo dos, Carlos and Gaby. All right. Eh, Carlita and Bismar. Daniel and Leti. Jorgito and Victoria. Debbie. Y Ever de Jesús. <laughs> Debbie estaba primero mañana, Debbie, porque eso sufrir a todos. Y Domingo and Johnny. No, ¿sabe qué? Vamos a pasar al grupo de Debbie ahorita y los demás pasan mañana. <laughs> All right, Debbie and Ever. All right, y luego con ellos y luego seguimos mañana con nosotros porque quiero avanzar con la actividad que nos falta. A ver, Debbie, no es nada personal, Debbie. Nada personal. El karma. Oye, <risa> <risa> qué cool. <risa> mañana no le, no le pongo ese karma. No te mañana. Mañana. <risa> mañana. Te... Night. <risa> We, we cannot share in this moment. De verdad, de Only verdad. putting in the lab. Yeah. Eso lo tenemos en el cuaderno. Ah, de veras. Bueno, pero entonces... We can share it only day. Mañana el primer grupo, all right? Igual okay. se mañana con los... ¿Alguien que quiera terminar ahora? Yeah. ¿Un grupo que quiera presentar? Ninguno. Oh, oh my God. Ya ve, por eso lo hago dedocráticamente, porque si lo digo así, voluntad. Bueno, entonces pre preguntémosle al verdugo, entonces a Debbie, que diga un número. <risa> claro, Debbie, usted con su dedo mágico, which number? <risa> four. Creo que por sí pasó. Ah, Daniel and Letty, perfect. Very good, Dani. You're ready. I know you're ready with Letty. Okay, Letty, please share the screen. Screen, please. Thank you, guys. You're so nice. Oh, that's so beautiful. <laughs> Olvide activar mi microphone. At this time, dress code is a is part waiter presentation. Previously, following the schedule it is important to keep internal control. Also, addressing customer is a way to be polite to customer. It makes them comfortable. Daniel, can you help me, please? Of course. Okay. <laughs> a part of this, addressing kitchen personnel share and getting along with the workers. Ah. Hey, se apagó, se apagó. I can see, no miro, no miro. <laughs> Oh, quiero ahora compartir otra vez. Quiero ver. You don't have a problem. <laughs> <laughs> okay, thank you. Um, ah. A part of this. A part of this. A part, no, miro. Eso mira. No. Yo no miro. <laughs> No, no mira, teacher. Yo no lo miro. <ríe> ok. Hey, lea, lea, por favor, yo no lo veo. No lo veo. Ah, vaya. A part of this, addressing kitchen personally, share and getting along with coworkers. Ah, ya lo veo. Ya lo veo. Bueno, ok. Without eh, okay. <ríe> a doubt. Can you continue? Uh, let me see. Without a go sitting a table is the image, it is the image of the restaurant. Getting to know the menu, now ingredients is each dish can be a good way 
to not receive complaints because it's important to know the product. The canteen wine to be attractive place. Uh, requesting a chief change, the personal new rest, <laughs> and prevention of accident and safety, organize everything in push to avoid accident. All right, organize. All right, very good. Uh, let me see. Okay. All right, yeah, it's a little bit difficult when you guys make the correction on the phone, but yeah. Solo hay unos eh, restaurantes, se le fue la E, pero es por, por, por supongo que el corrector. All right, so some uh, small mistakes there, More, mostly spelling. Very good, guys. Excellent, thank you. I'm very, very happy that most of you, de hecho, todos los grupos que presentaron ahora, you were including the words that we have been learning and we have been using, all right? And that's, that's very important, all right? So vi algunas como last but not least, uh, Say, um, what was the other one? <clears throat> I saw the other one. I saw, uh, apart from this, all right. So yeah, you guys are using subsequently also. So we're using some of the words and that's very good. What are you going to do now? All right, this is what you're going to do. I want you to think, well, you know what, wait. Right now I'm gonna show you this first. Vamos a hacer esto. I'm going to show you this right now. Solo para recordarles, esto lo vimos rapidito el viernes. All right, it says, what the most important purpose of a training manual is, eso lo tenemos que tener en mente, to provide a consistent method of communicating instructions to employees on how to perform the functions of their jobs. All right, ese es el de el por qué, el propósito de tener un training manual en muchos de nuestros trabajos existe. All right, tal vez en otros no tal cual se llame así, pero hay, un, hay lineamientos that we have to follow. All right, so they can be. So why do we need it? To provide a consistent method, all right? Like a met, like process, all right? Of instructions to employees. Acuérdense que esos training manuals son para los empleados, los colaboradores. ¿Para qué? Para realizar las funciones de sus trabajos de una mejor forma. All right. So that's why we need a training manual. Now, to make your training manual, vamos a hacerlo, eh, vamos a tomar esto en cuenta. Number one, provide step-by-step step sequences in the correct order. Lo que acabamos de hacer estaban step-by-step. Step pero en teoría no están in the correct order. Ahora, yo no trabajo en the food industry, all right? especialmente en restaurants. Puede ser que si nosotros conocemos un chef, all right? o alguien, un manager de un restaurante, él, nos, él o ella nos podría decir, ah, this is the correct order. Ahorita, nosotros como, como buenos, eh, I don't know, analistas, dijimos, ah, bueno, este es el orden. Y si se fijaron, los grupos que presentaron ahora, they had different orders. Not everybody was the same, all right? But that's okay, because we don't know, and we're learning, we're guessing, all right? Los también lo estamos viendo como el punto de vista quizás del, del customer, but that's okay. Entonces, es importante provide step-by-step step sequences in the correct order. Eso lo tenemos que tener bien claro. Number two. Follow the timing and sequencing, sequencing, sorry, of the actual operations. Como nos vamos a basar en algún, por ejemplo, yo trabajo con Debbie. All right, dale con Debbie. Ahora sí la agarré a Debbie. I'm sorry, Debbie mañana será eh, Carlitos. <laughs> All right, estoy trabajando con Debbie y decidimos de, si de mi trabajo o del de Debbie, vamos a hacer un training manual. ¿Cuál se presta más y cuál sería como más, no fácil, pero más accesible ahora? Provide visual stepping stones, all right? Cuando decimos visuals, eh, es importante, obviamente, no vamos a hacer uno formal ahorita, pero si, if, if you were, it's important to have visuals, all right? To have pictures. Si usted tiene el tiempo, podríamos, tuviéramos el tiempo, podríamos ponerle dibujito, ¿verdad? Because people are visual. Acuérdense que son de las inteligencias múltiples y hay mucha gente visual. 
All right, so we need to take that into account. Avoid, cuando hagamos nuestro manual, avoid lengthy paragraphs, así como un párrafo enorme, ¿verdad? Largo. La gente no lo lee, no lo entiende, se pierde y no le interesa. All right. Number five, use everyday words. Palabras que la gente entienda o que esté, no que entienda, pero que esté como más familiarizada. No tantos términos técnicos. Obviamente, si son necesarios, yes. Especialmente para equipo. All right. Pero así como los salvadoreños tendemos a hablar, así como darle como mil vueltas a algo. ¿verdad? Entonces, por eso ahí dice avoid jargon. Cuando decimos avoid jargon, es como evitar el bla, bla, bla. Y vamos directo to the point. Yes. All right. That's avoid jargon. Entonces, we're going to try to make a manual. Similar. Ocúpenlo de guía. Y por eso empezamos con la actividad del manual del libro. All right. Porque ellas nos dan algunas eh, tips, digamos, eh, de las cosas como ellos han escrito las, las cosas. Y si se fijan, son líneas. All right. That's it. It's only a sample, all right? Entonces, we don't really have much time right now, but it's good that you guys start your training manual. Remember, what I want you to do is I want you to, por cuestión de tiempo, quizás tengamos, si lograran tener 10 igual que acá, it would be good. Aquí no hay long sentences, no hay long paragraphs, son straight to the point. Puede tomar algunas, no me voy a poner todas igualitas porque ustedes no, que yo sepa, creo que nadie trabaja en restaurante, ¿verdad? Entonces, Gaby, que trabaja en una firma de, de, de abogados, ¿verdad, Gaby? No me va a poner setting the table y cuál table, o sea, y no sirve en mesa. All right, yeah, that's... The coffee. <laughs> the coffee, yeah, only the coffee. All right, or the canteen wine, Gaby, todo bien happy ahí en la oficina, all right? So, aplicado to your reality, all right? Yes, let's go, guys, empecemos. Si no logran llegar a las 10, por lo menos 5, sí. All right, yes? Okie dokie, let's go, guys. Trini estaba con Walter y Vicky todavía no puede unirse, that's okay.
Hi, teacher. Hi. Solo tenemos una pequeña duda. Dígame, Carlita. Sorry, Del... es que nos levantamos un momentito. No, no, no. <risa> dígame, dígame. Lo que vamos a hacer ahorita es este, como la, las training anteriores, ¿verdad? Sí, un man, una, unos pasos, digamos, para un training manual, ya sea de su trabajo o de Bismar. Ok. Ah, right. pues sí, no está tan perdida. Y así, no importa, okay. ¿verdad? Como lo que, lo que acabamos de, de ver en el manual de nosotros, de trabajo. Ok. Ando por todo lado. <ríe> También anda aprendiendo, dice. Sí, no se queda quieta. Ok. Ok, okay. Thank you. Thank you. Hi Leti, se salió. Hi teacher, sí, es que el otro teléfono no tenía mucha carga. Ah, vaya, ahí estaba con Daniel, ¿verdad? Sí. Bueno, ahorita. Gracias.
All right, guys, everybody's coming back. Carlita, did you finish? Yes, very good. Gabby, did you finish? No? All right, how many did you do, Gabby? Six. Oh, that's enough. Okay, that's fine. All right, very good. Uh, Walter, did you finish? Roberto, Victoria? Yes, it's All time right. to sleep. I know, it's almost. Yeah. All right, very good. All right, most of your classmates are coming back now. I'm gonna take attendance. All right, y los, igual yo ya tengo las capturas de los grupos que hicieron ahora. Eh, y mañana eh, iniciamos clase compartiendo lo de la actividad anterior and this one, all right? A ver, uh, everybody's back now, yes. Adela Trinidad González con suegra. Carlos Eduardo Melgar Rivas. Present teacher. Claudia Guadalupe Arias de Gómez. Present teacher. Daniel Antonio Luna. Present teacher. Evi Jasmine Girón Ramírez. Present teacher. Domingo Alexander González. Present teacher. Ever de Jesús Candray Montano. Present. Johnny Omar Torres Mata. Present. Jorge Alfredo Argueta Flores. Present teacher. José Roberto Martínez Bernabé. Present teacher. Present. Carla de Nacir Lara González. Present. Leticia Guadalupe García de Miranda. Present teacher. Hi, Stephanie, thank you. A Ramírez Abreu. Present teacher. Manuel Antonio Escamilla Jurado. Present teacher. María Gabriela Batres Mármol. Present. Paca Santa María. Present teacher. Vanessa Noemi Reyes Lemus. Present. Vicky Dinora Gutiérrez de Durán. Present teacher. Mar Ulises Martínez Ortiz. Present teacher. Walter Omar Castaneda Perlera. Present teacher. César Vega Aguilar. Doris Guadalupe Alfaro Rodríguez. Victoria María Vázquez Juárez. Present. And Joana Beatriz Orellana Acevedo. A ver, para los que terminaban de entrar cuando yo estaba, eh, empezaba a dar o terminaba de dar las indicaciones, mañana cuando iniciemos vamos a compartir los otros grupos de la primera actividad que hicimos, all right, del orden que ustedes le dieron y, y the, the reason why, y luego todos compartimos eh, lo que lograron hacer. Algunos grupos no terminaron, pero eh, se avanzaron, entonces vamos a compartir con lo que logramos hacer, all right. Thank you so much, eh, Roberto, José Roberto. No sé si se puede quedar un ratito y mañana le tocaría a Carlita. All right, y los okay. demás podemos despedir eh, y siempre con la plataforma, ¿verdad? Así es que sigamos con eso. Thank you, good night. Bye. Good night, teacher. Good night, teacher. Good night. Bye. 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 Good night, everyone. Good night, have a good night. Thank you, bye. Good night, Vane. Hi, Roberto. Teacher. Yes, Vane. Pregunta. Teacher, una pregunta. Sí. En inglés. Dígame, Vane. El, el verbo sumar, ¿cómo se dice? ¿El verbo? Hola. El verbo sumar, ¿cómo se dice en inglés? Ad. Sumar. Ad. Totales, add. Si usted quiere decir sumar los totales, add. Y add the totals. Así pagos, add. Sí, add, de. Ah, ok. Ah, pensé que era otro verbo por ser operaciones matemáticas. Pero, ah, vaya, entonces sí está bien. Sí, ese es igual, vale. Ah, vaya. Ah, ok, gracias. Bueno, Adiós, vale. feliz noche. Igual. <risa> Thank you. A ver, Roberto, eh, en, ese, en ese tiempo que nosotros eh, tenemos con ustedes, les hacemos la pregunta, ¿verdad? Si tiene alguna duda de lo que se ha visto hasta ahorita o anything that I can help you with. Mm, mm, no, no, teacher. Uh, it's okay. Only, only I think uh, 
we we have to practice uh, more uh, new vocabulary, for example, and the pronunciation. I, I think is is so uh, is very important that uh, that we that we repeat uh, in the class and and when when I study. Right. Right, yes. Yeah, it is very important, Roberto, to keep on learning more vocabulary, to practice in class, and also to listen after class or before class, right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Because that uh, makes your ear and your listening comprehension skills to improve, all right? Mm -hmm. that's, that's very important. Yes. Uh, now, for, for me, it's okay. All right, very good, yes. All yes. right, and we're learning a little bit every day. The good thing is that we listen and we practice a little bit. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, Roberto, very good. Con la plataforma, ¿cómo va? Eh, de la segunda idea de comenzado con las, con las actividades, con las tareas, mm -hmm. eh, solo me quedé en una donde estábamos viendo justamente el, el, el orden de las, activi de las actividades y eso no lo tenía tan claro hasta, hasta ahí me he quedado Ajá. digamos que con esto sí ya lo lograría okay. completar uh -huh. Muy bien, Roberto, está bien, súper bien bueno, usted sabe que aquí estamos a la orden para servirles, ahora hay cualquier cosa me dice, ok uh -huh. está bien right, Roberto, very good, good bueno. night, good night. Bye. bye bye